Listen to the heart of true love. True love is not something one does. It is not something one has. It is not a thing. It is not an action. It is not even a feeling. It is the cause. There is no strife in true love. It is always at ease. Listen to the heart of true love. When the true lover runs into difficulty, she stops and gives herself to it. She doesn't focus on her own comfort. Thus, problems are really no problem to her. Listen to the heart of true love. Love is equally available to the good and to the bad person, but to differing effects. Love is an inexhaustible treasure to the good person. No matter how lavishly it is bestowed, there is always more. Love is a refuge to the bad person. It doesn't judge and endlessly offers yet another chance. Listen to the heart of true love. Love is the mother. It is also the child. As the mother, love gives birth to all things, nourishes and cares for them, comforts and protects them, guides and cherishes them. As the child, love springs forth into life, unconscious and perfect. Love takes on a body, grows into fullness, recognizes itself, and returns to its source, only to become again. Listen to the heart of true love. Definitions cannot circumscribe love. We cannot say directly. Love both surrounds and pervades everything. It existed before the universe was born. Love is before everything. Everything is born of love. Love is the heart of all things. It is so common. Listen to the heart of true love. Love alone endures. Eventually all things, all experience, all memory vanish into it. It is formless and perfect.